Okay, so it's Wednesday and it is the 27th of November. The only reason why I'm saying that is because today is Lux's four months. Um, tomorrow is Thanksgiving and we are, we didn't do any shopping for what we have to make this Thanksgiving and we are going to two Thanksgivings, one at my family's house on Thursday, so tomorrow, and then one at Stefan's family's house on Friday. And we are bringing a little bit of things, sorry, lighting got dark. We're bringing some things to both of those events. So tomorrow I'm making sweet potatoes and Stefan's bringing some veggies and a cornbread, cornbread casserole. <laughs> and a cornbread casserole, which I've never had, but okay. Um, and We're of about course, to fight the uh, <laughs> last minute shoppers yeah. like us. He wanted to wait till the day before Thanksgiving to go. It's part of the experience. To go grocery shopping, excuse our house, it's a mess. Um, so yeah, here we are, Wednesday night, it's 5.15, Stefan got home a little bit early from work and we're about to head out to the store. Pray for us. <laughs> okay, so, last minute shopping, it's part of the experience. I like doing things last minute, because it's what I do. Sometimes uh, they don't have what you want, and other times they do, exactly. you can't complain. No, you can't complain because we could have did this on Sunday. But, ooh, so yeah. dark. Yeah, careful. Carrying the baby. Carsey. Oh, no, I'm saying it's dark to, oh. like, you can't see me. But, uh, probably head to Walmart, you know. They got everything. And then you always get some entertainment from uh, some of those folks there. So, we'll see. We are here. Whoa, why is it not zooming? Almost done. It's pretty crazy, but I like it. She doesn't. <laughs> Anxiety on one thousand. Yeah, for no reason. <laughs> We've only we're in Walmart, so we still have one more store to go to. Haven't quite made it out of Walmart yet. There's six hundred million people here. Not even kidding. Pretty sure carts have been ramming into each We're about to get hit right now. All night. It's crazy. And Lexi's just sleeping. We are at Sprouts. One of our... Way less busier. Oh, dropped Lux's jacket. <laughs> yeah, it's not so busy here at Sprouts. This is one of our favorite places. Um, so yeah. It's where you get all the, yeah, I guess it is like a cheap, cheaper Whole Foods, but it's nice and quiet here. <laughs> so a staple, of course, sweet potatoes and yams. Lux, she's, uh, she's quitting on us. Okay, so we are at our last stop. Oh, you can see the sign back there. Gomers. Yes, we had to go to a special store for the special ingredient for the sweet potatoes. Um, so my aunt, or my Tanta Feike, she usually makes the sweet potatoes, but I'm doing that this year. And the like very last little ingredient that goes in it is a little bit of rum. So comment if that's something that your family puts in there. Uh, most of the flavors I think kind of cooked out, but I guess it's like the secret ingredient. I don't know. But yeah, we're here. Gonna get some last little ingredient for the sweet potatoes and then we are done with our Thanksgiving shopping and gonna head home. Okay, it's Thanksgiving and Luxie's just now waking up. <laughs> She's usually happy in the mornings. Hi, Lexi girl. <laughs> Hi, pretty girl. Ooh. It's your first Thanksgiving. <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, not gonna put the camera on me because I look like butt, but boys always look normal in the morning. Um, yeah. It's cute. Oh, we gotta turn away from the. There's Happy Carol. Hi, pretty baby. 
She said, feed me already. I know. She's like, okay, I'm hungry. <laughs> Let's stop with the camera. You ready for some boobies? <laughs> you ready for some boobies? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, some boobies? <laughs> you hungry? So, uh, still looking rough, but we haven't had to go out yet. We're about to start uh, cooking. So we're in charge of sweet potatoes and Brussels and uh, cornbread casserole. Don't know who knows about that, if it's a north or south thing or I don't know. But um, the one thing that we had to go different wise is for butter since Kiana's going dairy free. Yeah, so. since I'm still nursing Lux, she has a little bit of a dairy allergy or sensitivity, so I've been dairy free since about two weeks after she was born. Okay, so we are finally on our way to my Umi's house. Um, crazy how long that took. Like, who remembers when you were little, you just, like, got in the car and went to your grandparents or something and ate, and now it's like, oh my gosh, we... A lot of preparing. Yes, lots of preparing, cooking all morning, um, and then shower, getting the baby ready. She's talking, I'm being here. But she helped um, because she was napping at least. Yeah, she took a long nap, which was nice. So we got to get literally everything done. Like both of us showered, changed, cooked everything. Like, and then we just woke her up right before we left, which was such a blessing. Um, so yeah, on our way to my Umi's house, um, we're gonna eat around four. It's like 2.30 right now. So we have some stuff we still have to kind of prepare when we get there, um, but overall oh and it is disgusting outside like we actually have normal clothes on underneath like windbreakers but it's freezing it's 34 degrees and it's raining it was snowing this morning just doing this like gross drizzle thing um so yeah not Midwest. A really, yeah not a really pretty day but yesterday it was like 55 and sunny so it's part of living in the midwest i thought we were gonna play cornhole today yeah thank god we're not because stefan is obsessed with cornhole so. <laughs> Whenever cornhole is involved, I don't exist. <laughs> Just kidding. That's all. Just keep on using me. Come on. Okay. Until you use me up. If you want some. You want lots of beer and stuff. <laughs> 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 like almost 11 I think no it's almost 10 okay it feels like it's almost 11 <laughs> it's or 12 9 50 <laughs> Lux was tired she held up pretty good for the most of the day being passed around to family member to yeah, member she did really really good but usually we go to her parents house after Thanksgiving to mm -hmm. set up Christmas decorations but she wasn't having it yeah she's on um, a pretty consistent like bedtime schedule and so it has its pros and cons so when yeah. <laughs> there's getting out of schedule it's all out of whack so yeah, she... okay so thanksgiving day two off to my parents house in topeka i'm gonna have turkey enchiladas so yeah we'll see how that goes oh man we forgot our food I have to go back upstairs <laughs> right quick <laughs> okay so um, we forgot our camera. Rookie mistake. Um, so we don't have much footage from my family's uh, Thanksgiving. But uh, we had some good food and played a couple of games. It was a good time. Just wanted to get uh, footage of that just to show how our two families kind of celebrate differently. Um, 
but once we got back, it was like a, a 55 minute drive turned into like an hour and a half or something because Lux was just straight up tired. Mm-hmm. She kind of uh, like hit a wall, like yeah, from <laughs> overstimulation being, from yeah. the two days of celebrating with a million yeah. people. Um, but the day after, um, she had her little holiday hangover <laughs> and she slept pretty much all day, it seemed like. Mm-hmm. And, uh, so I think she's recovered all the way. So, <laughs> yeah. But it was a good Thanksgiving. Yeah, and all together, uh, it was a really good Thanksgiving. So, yeah, we'll try and uh, stay more up to date, get videos out faster with different occasions. But mm-hmm. we're learning. So, thanks. Like, subscribe, comment. That. <laughs>